close your eyes and watch your breath. All the way as the breath comes in, all the way as the breath goes out. And be content to stay right here. You don't have to go anywhere else right now. You have no other responsibilities. But also don't go out wandering, looking for entertainment outside. Actually, there's a lot that can be seen right here in the breath, a lot can, that can be felt, a lot of pleasure that can be found by getting the mind in a concentration. If you content yourself with being here and don't keep thinking about where else you'd like to be. This tendency of the mind that wants to go someplace else. You've got something in one hand, you want to go running off and find something else. This lack of contentment, that's one of the big causes for lack of peace in the world. This is the season when everyone is singing about peace on earth. But when you look at it, why is there no peace on earth? It has, doesn't have anything to do with the earth itself. The earth is perfectly okay. The animal kingdom is pretty much okay. It's human beings that don't have a sense of enough. And as the Buddha said, it, even if there was a rain of gold coins, it wouldn't be enough to satisfy all the desires of the heart. That doesn't know contentment. So we have to learn some contentment if we want to have peace in this world. Because it's because of our greed, our aversion and delusion that we see all the trouble that we create and the trouble that other people create. Of course, we see them being greedy and aversive and delusive and say, why can't they stop that? We have to turn around and look inside first. Why can't we stop our greed and aversion and delusion? At the very least, because we have a background in the Buddhist teachings, we should know how to do it. The question is, why aren't we doing it more than we are? So that's what you want to learn, how to gain a sense of contentment, just being right here. This is a really good place to be because it's where all the important things are happening in the mind, all the things that you need to know. It may not be a pleasant place all the time, but if you're content to stay right here, you learn an awful lot. And ultimately you gain the kind of wealth that you can't get from money, you can't get from things outside or people outside. So that's what we want to develop here. That's why you want to have a sense of content, contentment right here, because that leads to peace, both peace of mind inside and a lot of less disturbance outside. If everyone could learn how to look for peace inside, this would be a much better place. But it has to begin with us, on the one hand, because we have the training. We've got the background, the Buddhist teachings, to tell us the way. You look at all the people out in the world who don't even know about the Buddhist teachings, who, who have all kinds of misinformation about the Buddhist teachings. They're really in a bad shape. But then, of course, we've got this tradition, why don't we use it more to bring more peace into our own lives? You want to live in a peaceful world, you have to make your mind peaceful. When we leave this world, okay, it's going to depend on the frequency of your mind. You tune into the frequency of other worlds. You want this mind to have a peaceful frequency, not one that's thrashing around. So learn how to be content right here, because this is where peace begins, right here, with a sense of contentment. That way you don't need any gold coins at all. You've got a wealth inside that no money can buy. <laughs>